This is blasphemy. This is madness. This is Sparta. This is where we fight. This is where they die. And the shield boys are part of the 12 tribes of Israel. What we claim is, according to the Bible, the so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native American Indians are the children of God. The white guy that you see posed for Jesus Christ was painted by Leonardo da Vinci and Michelangelo. His name is Caesar Borgia, the second son of Pope Alexander VI of Rome. Caesar Borgia was a child molester. He was also a faggot, and he killed his sister's husband to sleep with his sister. So he dealt with incest as well as being a murderer. I mean, you think white people are the devil? Absolutely, because the word devil just means deceiver. And so when we look all across this earth, who deceived all the other people on every continent thinking that they were something else? Only white people did that. It's good that we have cameras and technology of today because without that, the white man would claim everything like he did in the past. Whom is my brothers? Whom is my sisters? Who is my family? Those that do my father's will. So as far as a white friend, I mean, we don't necessarily need them because we have our brothers and our sisters under the nation of Yashar Allah. Our aim is to wake up the 12 tribes of Israel across the four corners of the earth. They are the so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native American Indians. Name another people on the planet that took weapons of mass destruction to put it on other people. Can I ask you a question? Um, no, you can't until you answer that question. Who did that? The white man, yes or no? As in, has there ever been a violent act committed by a black person? Absolutely. We sp violent acts are different from acts of mass destruction. They're okay. two different things. There's no way in the world we can defeat the so-called white man with war. We don't have no heat-seeking missiles. We can buy a little 38 revolver, a little Uzi, a little shotgun. We, we don't have bombs. This is a spiritual war, and we're trying to raise up our people to keep the law, statutes, and commandments of the Heavenly Father so we can adapt our spiritual power and then y'all will have no other way but to submit. You understand? When we got God on our side, he can make, he can, he can, he can make a, a, a glitch in the computer system where y'all can't use your nuclear defense system when North Korea sends them over here. Why doesn't he do that now? Because it's everything has to be done according to the order, like I just told you. The white man has always been a consumer everywhere that he goes on this planet Earth. And that goes back to the, to the question that you asked even about war. You shall be destroyed. Thus saith the Lord. The reason being is because the way that you carry yourself on this earth and conduct yourself. You never conduct yourself as a human being because you can't be human. Hu human comes from two words. Hue, which means color, and man. You're not a human being. Okay, okay, okay. You're shouting. You're shouting at me. Why am I shouting? I'm talking loud? You're shouting at me. I'm talking loud? You're being aggressive. Okay, let me ask you what. Here's, here's, here's my question. You're being rude. You want, hey, you want hey, to hurt me. Sir, I don't care. Here's my question. Here's my question, here's my question sir. Sorry, let me ask you this. The rainbow, right? Yo, the rainbow. Yo, the symbol of the rainbow. Oh, pet. I never, the symbol of rainbow. Who was that taken from? Can you just just say I can't believe it's not butter. <laughs> Just say that one time. Right, so you're not believing my butter. It's coming on your ass. <laughs> and I'm going to make sure as soon as that gorilla break your ass, and you're not going to do that no more. What can you do sleep on another man? What what can life can you bring forth? What life can you bring forth? Answer my question. In the bed with another Teach hairy, me sweaty as man. a fucking homo. What life can you bring forth sleep on another man? What life can you bring forth sleep with another man? What life can you bring forth? I don't care about your feelings. I'm talking about life. The extinction of life. That's why man was created in God's image. Why? Man has the only thing to procreate. So where's the procreation coming from? You sucking another man's dick or another man's dick up your ass. Where's that? You're all right, man. Bring it out. Bring it out. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Where's it at? Sorry. I cannot teach you anything if you're You can't teach me because you are a drag of society. Understand that, man. Right, man. You yeah, can't yeah. procreate, man. Don't you ever tell me no bullshit, because here's what they do as homosexuals. Oh, you know what? It's about love. So now you got a bunch of orphanages all across this earth. Right. So why don't you have nothing but homosexuals registered in orphanages that they want to adopt children? Because all they want to do is fuck and get their ass broken in. You're a goddamn demon. You're a fucking liar that the Bible speaks about, the Quran speaks about, the Methodists speak about, you name it, you're a damn demon and you know it.
That's you right. not making you won't make you cry. Make you make make you make don't make hurt cry. my feet. The hell out of here, man. Because if it was up to me, I'd choke the shit out your ass right in that corner. I'd just choke you. I'd choke you, man. I'd fucking keep fucking choking, man. I'm fucking choking, man. Get the fuck out of here. You see what you talk to me? I would choke you. Fuck out of here. I was supposed to talk to you. You ain't no woman. I was supposed to talk to you. You're fucking mad. Just say I can't believe it's not bought. Fuck out of here. You just want to You just want to talk. I want to talk to you. You went to Catholic school? I am You went to Catholic school? There you go. Uh, you have no idea. Got you on the record. You are talking about love. What is love? What is love? What is love? What is love? Sorry. What is love? Jesus told you. Told what is love according Jesus to God? What is love? You to love your enemies. Child, look at look the way you look at the way. Oh, fuck out of here. You are enemy to God. Look at the way you're treating me. Okay. Tell me, this is the way you love. I got you. Speak God's first commandment. You are so serious. That's why you're treating me badly. Just be quiet. Because I'm not Catholic. I'm not none of that. I am not treating you badly. Let's you read what God said. Read what God said. Genesis chapter see, you, you brought the Catholic shit. You brought it to me. You brought it to me. Because, so here's the book. Read what he said. Genesis because, chapter 1 verse 28. Come on. Right. And God blessed them. Come on. And God said unto them, Come on. be fruitful. He said be fruitful in what? And be multiply. And multiply. Read it again. He That's said be right. fruitful, fruitful and, and multiply. multiply. He said what? Be, be fruitful, fruitful and, and multiply. multiply. Come on. On this earth, so get the fuck out of here and out my face, as I would choke the shit out you. If I listen, let me tell you, I'm a different breed. I come from the old school. I would chop your fucking head off. Right? Homosexuality don't belong on this planet. You're the fucking devil that the Bible speaks about even deeper because you don't believe in nothing but your goddamn self. You're a fucking sexual deviant. You fucking freak. Get the fuck out of here, man. You're a sexual deviant. Get the fuck out of here, man. You say you. You said, get the fuck out of here. You said, I'm not gonna waste my time on you. I'm talking about I'm done. Talk to him. But I'm you done. cannot listen to anybody. You're a you sexual deviant, bro. You cannot, you're not able to learn anything. And with that, I'm gonna learn from you. What the fuck you want me to learn from? What the fuck you want me to learn from you? What the fuck you want me to learn from you? What the fuck you want me to learn from you? Fuck out of here. God bless you. I wish you learned from you. Okay? I can't believe it. Love your enemies and listen to them. What I was trying to show him is that you look, you are talking about Christianity, uh, Christian values, and look at the way you're treating me. It's the opposite. Fucking hell, man. I feel so bad. Like, because no. I was there in moments, like, I just fucking showed up there. I didn't. I didn't know, I just asked him a question, what, what the story was, because they were dressed unusually, and then we got into the thing, and he was saying stuff to me that I was just, I was just off the cuff, because I hadn't planned it, you know, I asked them, they said yes, and then at the end it was fucking chaos, I didn't know. It was good to, you know, for Because at points, to, man, like at points, at points I didn't think, yeah. at points I never ever thought he would hit you, but then at points I really thought he might hit you. Yeah. I mean, so I, it was I, good I, that you I, left because I thought that was awful. Yeah. I don't feel bad because of myself because I don't feel hurt by things like this. And the reason why I talk to these kind of people is also because I want to overcome this. You know what I mean? I used to be afraid of people like this. Now, I mean, it's not like something that I face every day. Shout, not someone shout at me like this. Yeah, I mean, because man, yeah, it, 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 it's, it's actually good. Like, <laughs> I'm afraid of that guy, and you should be afraid of that guy because you know he he is violent. You know and. Probably. He's violent, yeah. And, it, and I'm it, just it, saying. It's, it's interesting that he, so at the same should. time, speaking about Christianity and, and the Bible and whatever, like he didn't get anything or whatever. You know, this, this book is full of contradictions anyway. Man, my point is you could be Muslim yeah. or Christian or yeah. Jewish or fucking whatever the fuck you yeah. want to be, yeah. and nobody gives a shit. You know, nobody yeah. cares because. You know, that's just, that's that's what good people just don't give a shit because yeah. you're just a person, it doesn't matter. And a lot of those religions, in my belief, yeah. really say the same thing and at the roots I it's know. a positive thing. So I, I think in a situation like that, you're best walking away. You're never ever going to win an argument with somebody who's closing the mind.